how to look at your iPad scanned object. You got an email and here you got a zipped file with your model. Let's open it up. It's downloaded. Click on it and then choose extract the files. So we extract all of them. I say OK to the download position and say extract. Now we have the files. OBG is the 3D file. The others should follow into the same folder. So let it be in that position. Now we need a software for this. I propose Mesh Mixer. Open up a web window, search for Mesh Mixer, choose Download. Choose what is good for your computer. Do you have a Mac? Choose Mac. If you have a Windows machine, choose Windows 64 or 32-bit. Accept to install. Push done. Open up Mesh Mixer. And now we could import our file. I like drag and drop. I take the OBG file and drop it into Mesh Mixer. There we go. We have the model. You could tumble in space with right mouse key, middle mouse key, you could move sideways. Now we would like to change the scale here. Choose Analyze, Units and Dimensions. In this case, this model is only 0 0.57 millimeter. That is completely wrong. Of course, you know the size. I make a guess here. How about 500 millimeter? Now we have adjusted the scale we would like to rotate the object. Push done for the scaling. Choose edit, transform. Click on this and here you could follow the, the lines here to have exactly 90 degree. You can move it a little bit closer to Z0. That's good enough. Accept. Now let's clean up the model a little bit. Blue lines means cracks. Choose Edit, Close Cracks. There we go. Now you could decide to continue to clean or you could just have fun. If you choose Sculpt, you could choose a brush, pick whatever brush you like. And then you could move on to the object, hold down left mouse key and drag. Okay, that's it. 
If you prefer to do a 3D print, you need to move on. You need to make it need to make it watertight to be able to 3D print it. A quick solution here is to go for edit, make solid. Another possibility is to go for analyze and the inspector. So you have two different approaches. Inspector is more careful with your original object. Make solid is more quick and dirty. Let's try the inspector. It shows errors. We could choose to try to auto repair. So I click auto repair. And there we go. A watertight solid object. Done. The final thing you need to do for 3D printing is to go for File, Export, and choose STL. Okay, so give this object a good name. Choose STL binary and choose Save. Done.